Hey everyone, Creative Venus here and this is the part 3 of beautiful business infographic design. But before moving further, let's watch this video. Mindmaster is an amazing collaborative and brainstorming tool and here you can create various charts like tree map, Gantt charts, radial map and all these charts. And it is very easy to create. Once you have clicked on the chart, you can easily create it by using the panel on the right and at the top. Just click on the buttons and you will get the desired output. Here you can change the text, its color, change the color of the nodes and you can highlight specific text and it is very easy to create and the best part is this chart automatically aligns everything and you can change the background as well and you can see we don't have to adjust anything. These features are so intuitive. Once your chart is complete, you can export it in your desired format like PDF or an image. And for more information about Mindmaster, just check out the links in the video description. So coming back to the tutorial, in the part 2, we have finished the infographic design. And you can see the output here. But in this design, some final steps are left and we will further beautify it we will add content and some aesthetic some uh, some shapes to further enhance the enhance the design so here we have inserted this rounded rectangle and placed it here and just apply the inward shadow fill gray color change the shadow color to something light or maybe close to dark gray now insert a circle and we will add content here for that remove its outline make sure the height and width of the circle is same and change the color and we have filled the color from one of the shapes in the bulb and here you can add heading so this is the dummy text of course you can change it as per the requirement of the slide and the content you can also change the text style here I always say in my video other than the design text styling is also very important and equal focus should be given on text styling as well the way you write things uh, you can always highlight important keywords you can underline you can change the colors and and you can you know bold the important keywords that you want the user to see at first so that's how you can do it so here is the description and you can write some numbers here like percentage some growth rate or something like that so that's all you can do here now what we have to do is we have to make sure that things are aligned we have grouped them together in order to group the text or shapes you have to select the items and press ctrl plus g on your keyboard now let's insert a nice icon here so last week my office 365 has been updated and I've got some cool icons in it some stock images people cut out so this is really amazing office 65 is going to next level and I really love it because now everything is integrated you don't have to search for images and the stock images are already there in built in the PowerPoint then you have those stickers and now we have these thin line icons as well so that's a really big move because nowadays thin line icons are in demand and i personally use them a lot 
so i have already selected some random icons here and we will place them on each shape and its respective and its respective shape in the bulb and change the color to white so that we can see it now again i have grouped it now we just have to reuse this grouped component or you can say the collection of text and shapes component so it's pretty easy so, so it is so it is very easy and you can do it so i have I have increased the speed of this video because the steps are repetitive and you can add text as I have explained for the first part. So now you have now, now you have added all the information on this slide and the slide design is almost complete so the slide is done now it's up to you if you want to enhance it to make it more beautiful like i did it i have added this background so it's looking really nice so that's what you all can do so if you like this video and this complete three-part series please give a thumbs up please like this video and all the three videos now i will leave a download link g drive download link for this infographic in this video please go there and download this link and please subscribe to our channel which is very important join the membership that will support us and i would say thank you thank you for watching all of our videos and sharing your love so we will see you guys in our next video with something more beautiful and creative till then bye bye